All right, a bizarre crime left a business owner shelling out money to replace a trash can. Security cameras catching it all unfold. Here's our lead pack with tonight's Caught in the Act. Caught in the Act on Fox 10 is sponsored by Hunter Security. Your security is our business. There's one at just about every home and business, but you won't find a trash can at Healthy Beginnings Hair and Nail Salon. If someone called and said I had a bunch of trash dumped in the uh, parking lot, it's like, well, why is it not in the garbage can? She said, I can't find the garbage can. So she, I said, I'm on my way. When she got to her salon, Sonia Roberts went straight to her security cameras. It didn't take long to find out what happened to the trash can. It was Tuesday night around 730. Not long after they closed, two guys roll up in a small truck and loaded it up. I circled the neighborhood, then they finally came up in the truck, cut the truck off in the middle of the street, as you can see in the cameras, cut the lights off, came here, got the trash can, and they dumped it like right where my car is dumped. I mean, a lot of trash. They probably didn't notice in their rush to get away, but each can has a serial number where it can be tracked. Sonia, in the meantime, called the city of Mobile and was told it'll cost $53 to replace her trash can. Another added expense for a small business. They've been here for 18 years, never had any problems until now. I was, I was shocked because I actually thought it may have been kids just playing around or something, but when I saw it was two adult, two adult men, I was just disappointed and disappointed that they dumped the trash out. You're going to take the trash can and take the trash too. At least don't make me clean up the trash. So I was disappointed. While it's hard to make out who they are, take another look at the truck. It's an old one with distinctive stripes on the side. If you know who they are, turn them in. With tonight's Caught in the Act, Lee Pack, Fox 10 News. If you have video of someone caught in the act, email it to us at Fox 10 reported at Fox 10 TV.com. And you never know, we might show it in our newscast.